What about lessons in parenting? Right. Um, <laughs> lessons in parenting. Um, there isn't no um, quick answers. I mean, we have worked with a lot of different um, professionals that have come in to help us in the home. And, um, <clears throat> like, they've set up, like, reward charts and everything. And it is like a quick fix. Um, it works for a little while and then it stops working. Um, all four of our children are can be quite violent and, and very aggressive. Um, like we mentioned, they have attacked us, they will attack each other. Um, you can kind of get a sense of feeling when they're going to kick off. And if you can nip it in the bud before it starts, I'd say that is the, the best lesson. Um, if you don't, and then they lose it, um, it is very hard to get back in control. Um, and nothing works, you know, you can take things away, you can ground them, um, but nothing works because they've gone past that point of no return and the only thing you can do is split them up, isn't it? Yeah, divide. Yeah, divide them, that's what we've found to be the best um, answer. Um, it is, um, like I said, it isn't easy. Um, and also, um, getting it recognised as being part of the condition, the behaviour, um, doctors will say it's not related. Um, also, um, headaches. Um, I ha we have a, our eldest boy, he get, has a constant headache and he's been told um, by doctors that that is not a link. But if you like um, go on the Cavanova website, you'll see that there's a lot of other people with headaches and that their children are quite aggressive as well. So I definitely think there is a link there definitely a link there with that. Um, all you can do, I mean, parenting, I feel um, a failure, or no, actually, correction, I've been made to feel a failure as a parent. I've been made to, I've actually been told um, that I've caused the children's problems. Um, and like this journey, we've actually been on a journey for about five years with all this now, haven't we? Yeah. And um, we've kind of like come out the other side. I think I'm a lot stronger, you know, um, person for it but what I have realized is it's not my fault it's not you know Brian's fault as a parent um, it's really important to stay strong isn't it together and yeah. work together yeah. um, because it isn't about blame or anything um, it's just um, you know parents know their children um, the best and you can only do what you can as a parent and try um, your best um, to be a good parent. There's no good and bad parent, and I don't think. You just have to go and try your best every day as a parent, really. And try and treat them as, uh, just as you would a normal child. Yeah. And put the boundaries in, just yes, like you, you have a normal to have, child. Yeah, you have to. You still have to. You can't let them get away with the behaviour. Um, you can't. We try and treat them all the same, don't we? Yeah. But one of our, again, our biggest problems is having all four children is they, you know, feed off one another and they'll say, well, you treat them different to how you treat me. <laughs> Their problems, Are you know, you, you have to treat them differently in a way. So that causes problems um, within the home as well, doesn't it, Brian? Yeah. So, um, but yeah, um, oh, I don't know about you, how you feel as a parent. No, I think you've covered it all, really. <laughs> <laughs>